Hello friends, let's discuss the following question. It says, find the equation of the plane which contains the line of intersection of the planes vector r dot i cap plus 2 j cap plus 3 k cap minus 4 is equal to 0 and vector r dot 2 i cap plus j cap minus k cap plus 5 is equal to 0 and which is perpendicular to the plane vector r dot 5 i cap plus 3 j cap minus 6 k cap plus 8 is equal to 0. Now if we are given two planes vector r dot vector n1 is equal to d1 and the plane vector r dot vector n2 is equal to d2 then equation of plane through the intersection of the two given planes is given by vector r dot vector n1 minus d1 plus lambda into vector r dot vector n2 minus d2 is equal to 0 where lambda is any real number. And we also need to know that if we have two planes vector r dot n1 is equal to d1 and vector r dot n2 is equal to d2 then the planes are perpendicular if and only if vector n1 dot vector n2 is equal to 0. So this knowledge will work as key idea behind this question. Let us now move on to the solution. Two given planes are vector r dot i cap plus 2 j cap plus 3 k cap minus 4 is equal to 0 and vector r dot 2 i cap plus j cap minus k cap my plus 5 is equal to 0. Let's call this as 1 and this as 2. Now we have to find the equation of plane through the intersection of these two planes. So equation of plane through the intersection of 1 and 2 is given by Vector r dot i cap plus 2 j cap plus 3 k cap minus 4 plus lambda into vector r dot 2 i cap plus j cap minus k cap plus 5 is equal to 0. Now this is equal to vector r dot 1 plus 2 lambda i cap plus 2 plus 1 lambda j cap plus 3 minus lambda k cap minus 4 plus 5 lambda is equal to 0. Let's call this as A. Now we are given that this plane is perpendicular to the plane vector r dot 5i cap plus 3j cap minus 6k cap plus 8 is equal
equal to 0. Now we will use the condition for two planes to be perpendicular which is vector n1 dot vector n2 is equal to 0. Now here vector n1 is 1 plus 2 lambda i cap plus 2 plus lambda j cap plus 3 minus lambda k cap and vector n2 is 5i cap plus 3j cap minus 6k cap. Now we take the dot product of vector n1 and n2. Now vector n1 dot vector n2 is equal to 5 into 1 plus 2 lambda plus 3 into 2 plus lambda minus 6 into 3 minus lambda. Now the dot product of n1 and n2 is 0 because the plane is perpendicular to this plane. Now this is equal to 5 plus 10 lambda plus 6 plus 3 lambda minus 18 plus 6 lambda is equal to 0. And this implies 19 lambda minus 7 is equal to 0. And this again implies lambda is equal to 7 upon 19. Now put lambda is equal to 7 upon 19 in A. Now A is vector R dot 1 plus 2 lambda, lambda is 7 upon 19, I cap plus 2 plus lambda J cap, plus 3 minus lambda, K cap, minus 4, plus 5 lambda, is equal to 0. Simplifying this, we get vector R dot 19, plus 14 i cap plus 38 plus 7 j cap plus 57 minus 7 k cap minus 76 plus 35 is equal to 0. Now this is equal to vector r dot 33 i cap plus 45 j cap plus 50 k cap minus 41 is equal to 0. Now r is the position vector of any arbitrary point on the plane. So let vector r be x i cap plus y j cap plus z k cap. So we have x i cap plus y j cap plus z k cap dot 33 i cap plus 45 j cap plus 50 k cap minus 41 is equal to 0. Now taking the dot product of these two vectors, we have 33x plus 45y plus 50z minus 41 is equal to 0. Hence the required equation of the plane is 33x plus 45y plus 50z minus 
minus 41 is equal to 0. So this completes the question. Bye for now. Take care. Have a good day.